Hey there friends, thanks for checking in. Today we're exploring the question, did everybody forget about the 22 TCM? All the attention has been on the 5.7 by 28 millimeter because other companies have been making firearms chambered in this round, but then there's the 22 TCM. It's, it's made by Arms Corps. From everything that I've seen, no other ammo company is developing it, but Arms Corps makes a ton of it. And it costs on the average about 20 rounds for a box of 50. Now this is a jacketed hollow point, both bottleneck down rounds, both 40 grain bullets. But you, if you look at them side by side, you can see that the 5.7 by 28 millimeter right here is a little bit taller, a little bit more, or a little bit thinner case, I should say. But both extremely fast rounds. Now the 22 TCM travels at approximately 2,100 feet per second, and that is, pretty darn fast. I, I've done some range tests with it already and I've shown that it could take a regular patio stone or cinder block and turn it into sand, like just completely destroy it as where a 22 long rifle just put chips out of it. But what I have here is a Rock Island 1911. It's a TCM model and Rock Island is the main developer of the 22 TCM. You do see some Glocks with conversion barrels for 22 TCM. But here's what we're looking at. This is a single stack. Many of their 1911 offerings now are double stack. So I'm not even sure if this is developed. Now when I got this, it was a combination package that also offered a barrel for nine millimeter as well as a recoil spring. They do share the same magazines, although the 22 TCM is a little bit thinner. The case is a little bit thinner. It was explained to me that it's actually a bottleneck case that mimics the 223 but nonetheless we're gonna shoot this thing you don't mind do you didn't think so I had this well let me shoot these and I'll talk about my original intentions let's start over on the left there we go very it's a fast round it's a fun round it's a loud round and it has very low recoil. I'm gonna demonstrate that in a little bit. The one thing that I've noticed is that these mags are not dropping free. And I can't remember if it's always been that way. I got this in 2017 and haven't shot a lot with it, but I certainly do enjoy the round. I, I've never not enjoyed the round but my original intention was to do a comparison with the 22 tcm and the 5.7 by 28 millimeter we had a problem with the chronograph i, I was hanging out with trees blown we, we had the chronograph all set up and it wasn't reading properly so that video is on hold i know other people have done videos of that nature mine are not very scientific i'll tell you that right now trying to get a little more scientific by using a chronograph as well as a couple other things but a uh, big muzzle flash very loud very fast round and it takes a cinder block and turns it into sand but with my last review a lot of people liked it when i did this i just turned it around let me raise the camera a little bit and this way you can see the recoil as I fire it. So let's do that. I've got the thumb safety engaged. All right, 22 TCM, approximately 12, 13 yards away. Oh, little bottleneck there. Let's see if I can remove that. Is it jumping around? Doesn't feel that way. I'm transitioning and that's it so my plans are to do more with 22 TCM I think it's a great round I think that you know with the with the Glock conversion and some of the rifles that are being made I know Rock Island makes a, a map a part of their map series that takes CZ mags that has the 22 TCM 9R. Now the 9R is just a, it's a 39 grain bullet instead of a 40 grain bullet, but it's just a little, just a little bit shorter 
so it fits in those CZ mags that you could use it in the map series and with some of the other mags that are primarily set for nine millimeter. These mags, you know, it's not gonna make that much of a difference, but this will shoot the 9R, it's just that the other ones won't shoot the 40 grain 22 TCM, uh, TCM ammo because it's just a little bit longer and it, it sticks in the mag itself and it just doesn't feed as smoothly but here it is rock island uh, it's a tac series 22 tcm it's a great round i'm going to do some comparisons with the 5.7 by 28 millimeter and i think that's something that may be pretty cool i'm going to still try to get that chronograph to test the velocity if you like videos like this please subscribe and share i always appreciate thumbs up button thanks for watching and you guys be safe.